your girl, the Empress Chanel, coming at you with a weekly reading. Yay! So y'all wanted me to bring back the weekly um, readings. So that's exactly what I'm going to do, the weekly elemental readings, all right? So today we're going to do, well, y'all know, um, Mondays, which is today, we're going to do the water signs. Tuesdays, we're going to take it back like how we used to do. Tuesdays, is going to be the fire signs. Wednesdays, we're going to have the air signs. And Thursdays, we're going to have the earth signs. And Fridays, we're going to do our ancestor messages or whatever. Whatever spirit God is doing. Whatever. All right. Dear my loving and most high my personal angels, ancestors, spirits, guides, and guardians, I ask that you clarify this message from you through me. Cover me in the whitest light from the highest vibration as I deliver this message. Cover my collective in the whitest light from the highest vibration as they receive this transmission. Gratitude, gratitude, and gratitude. And Reiki has been infused on this video. You can set the energy or you can reject the energy it is for the greater good of all and for the harm of none if you reject the energy it is programmed to recycle back to me if i need it or to be transmuted to wherever it is needed the most in this world all right so let's get some oracles out here we're going to see what we got going on monday so we're going to be doing cancer scorpio pisces water signs all right We have Lord Ganesh, removal of all obstacles. We have a clear path ahead. We have St. Saint Francis, Saint Francis, animal communication. And we have Archangel Ariel, environment of, what is this? Environment abundance, guardian of the earth. Okay, so we know Lord Ganesh, he is usually represented by either a mouse or an elephant. So, um, something in reference to someone having some sort of blockage when it comes to some sort of animal, animal guide or totem, or maybe someone was trying to block your animal guide or totem, or your ability to connect with animals or your animal guide. What we got at the bottom of the deck, we have Horus, clear seeing intention and perspective okay so some somebody did not want someone to see your intentions as pure two for two on the timer as i say that let's get some of these oracles out here and then we're going to get into several for the water signs oh we have service here in reverse with lord ganesh That was too many cards, but I did see fortune. Let's see, St. Francis. Faithfulness, and St. Francis is, like I said, animal communication. And what's on here? A dog. And we have soldier here. Conversation at the bottom of the deck. Hope. Love. And prison. Ooh. And what we got at the bottom of the deck? Reunion. Wow, so somebody saw that somebody's um, intention was to get someone to either go back to jail or be reunited with some sort of um, storyline or timeline where they would be headed to some sort of prison or imprisonment. Um, someone tried to attach somebody to a timeline in reference to um, harming animals or something like that. Um, I know here in my state, when they put like if if something is like a general uh, bond or something like that um they will put like they won't put exactly what it is that you were locked up for or something like that or what the hearing was for it'll say something like bond slash animal something so it's like something that's kind of like 
not public or some, something like that. I, I don't know what it is, but somebody tried to attach something like that to somebody, that somebody um, did some sort of harm to animals. Um, I don't know, I think somebody has some sort of obstacle or blockage or they feel like their animal has some sort of blockage. Maybe somebody told them that somebody put a blockage on their animal. That somebody did some sort of magic or, or something like somebody's out here lying on somebody's gifts. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Let's get into it. Let me get a 10 card spread for Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Here we go. Cancer straight out the gate with the chariot and the queen of cups. So a feminine cancer or somebody who has cancer in their chart, you can look up somebody's chart, just put in their birthday um, and their city and the link that I have in my description box. And you can see if there's sun, moon, rising, Venus is cancer. All right, it's cancer again. Heavy on the fucking cancer. We got Cancer with the Chariot, Cancer with the Queen of Cups, Cancer with the Four of Cups. Aries, Taurus, Six of Pentacles here, the Emperor. The star, Aquarius. And y'all know the um, chariot is about obstacles, overcoming obstacles. Somebody was trying to siphon the uh, protection or the energy of Lord Ganesha off of a light one so that they can remove their own obstacles. But it didn't work. They paid for some sort of service to be done, for some sort of energy to be transferred toward them. This could be a sibling, lovers, Gemini energy right here. But somebody makes good choices. They make the right choices. They go toward healing. Somebody holds a very prominent position in the public or in the public's eye. That's the truth. Ace of Souls. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini right there. That's also in the position of um, spiritual advice in reference to hopes and fears. So someone is scared that they are going to, um, where they were once seen um, as the victor, they're about to find out or they are now finding out or feeling that this was a hollow victory, that it meant nothing in the end. Oh, they did all of that, I heard, for nothing. Yep, Three of Swords. Broke their own heart. Libra energy right here. Or someone may have healed from some sort of heartbreak or ail ailment in reference to the heart. High Priestess. King of Cups here. Scorpio energy. Pisces energy. Yo, water signs is all up and through here. 838, I just saw on my timer. Okay? Because we got Pisces right here. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces all out here. Real of fortune. Something is over. Something is ending. Like I said, some sort of karmic cycle or wheel that somebody just kept somebody on. Somebody just kept saying something about somebody over and over again. And it just kept perpetuating some sort of cycle. that someone has overcome it's because of some sort of um they got into the energy of having some sort of unbiased opinion um in reference to something i saw eight of cups um so somebody just matured somebody just matured emotionally they walked away yeah nine of pentacles virgo energy right here self-sufficient abundant on your own this could be a reference to some sort of like a business Somebody may have placed, somebody was hoping that um, there was some sort of um, obstacle that may have been placed over someone's business. They were hoping that it was still there. Um, and it's not. 
they see that you are self-sufficient, abundant, um, you're not codependent. They needed you to need them or somebody that they were connected to. Um, I, I just keep getting abundance by association vibes, yeah. Page of Wands. Queen of Cups here. Somebody may have consulted some sort of um, spiritualist or uh, someone who dibbles and dabbles in that. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Four of Pentacles. And they found out that you are the good news, that you have good news, that you're building and growing and moving forward. Someone is upset that they got good news about you when they weren't even supposed to be looking. First of all, ain't nobody supposed to tap into good. Y'all gonna learn about tapping into high vibrational people's energy. Y'all gonna learn. There's always something in the shadows watching, taking note. You're not supposed to do that shit. It's called the universal law of permission. Look it up. I can't even do Reiki on somebody who hadn't asked for permission or hadn't given me permission it just doesn't work like that and that could even be right here with service in reverse maybe somebody thought that you was just by you being around or by them being in your energy or being able to physically touch you or be around you or something like that that or you're showing them love or something like that that um they wouldn't have to ask for your services they go around talking shit about your services or whatever it is that you do but they want it secretly. And they thought that they would just be able to get it by being around you, like you a healer and blah, blah, blah. They maybe seen you heal somebody else around you that was completely cold hearted, um, very controlling here. We have with the four of pentacles and the uh, emperor right here in the past position. And now they see how generous this person is. Um, um, how emotionally mature and balanced um, this person is. With this Four of Pentacles clarifying the Four of Cups, someone feels like they missed out on something or like you're hiding something from someone. They may have even started that rumor as well. Anything to try to get a group, because this is in the undermining position, to undermine someone's authority spiritual authority they feel like chronological age here on this planet gives rank over spiritual authority and god spirit allah buddha whoever it is that you subscribe to had to show somebody in front of a group of people that's not how that goes down what's in this undermining position what's this six of pentacles This Six of Pentacles is giving me the energy of someone being generous, but uh, they got somebody filming them. Like, here, here, take my picture, take a video of me giving this person this. And, um, you know, so I'll just look like such a nice person. It's like um, someone held something back from you, but the way that they want to give it to you because they see that whatever they was doing is like going to land them probably in prison. Um... Or they're in a mental imprisonment because of something but either way it's like they want to be seen as generous so they're making people like hey take a video of me do this or something like that but something is coming into balance here with the four clarifying the four clarifiers we got the world card right here I said in front of a group of people, a collective of people, the world and the, um, so this could be something that's on the internet. Somebody want to post something online because you know the world sometimes for me is like the world wide web, something that everybody can see. Wow, that's, that's, this is, <laughs> this is crazy because I wrote, um, in my dream works it's actually on my phone i haven't done it yet but y'all know how i do my dream works when i show it i show the date and time and everything um this was day before yesterday i had a dream and part of the dream i'm not going to say the whole thing right now dream download that i got but um it was something about me proving or it's like it was like um whoever i was in the dream download it was like i felt like i didn't i shouldn't have to prove anything but fuck it 
because it's been going on for so long and I just wanted it to be over with so I went to like some sort of embankment and basically I got in the water I had on like a blanket when I got in the water but like I was naked under a blanket I don't know we're gonna get into all that that's why I'm not even gonna go there yet <laughs> so we have knight of wands right here clarifying the emperor so like I said, somebody was probably abusing their power, um, very harsh, very frivolous with their energy all over the place. Maybe somebody was a party goer in the past, blah, blah, blah. And it's almost like their energy was calmed, tamed, healed. Um, the star card right here also represents um, having the ability to appeal to some sort of collective. And it's also a reference to healing. Nine of Wands here. Wounded warriors. Something about these soldiers right here. These could be service animals or service dogs. I don't know if they do like service dogs in the military. Um, I'm not sure. Um, this may even be something. Something is in reference to um, service animals having PTSD or something like that. There's something in reference here to uh, some sort of healing or animal healing. So what's this here, Gemini, the lovers? The devil here, also of influence. So somebody definitely, somebody may even have some sort of um, show. Someone wanted to talk to somebody in reference to creating some sort of show or something with the public, but somebody wanted to be like the star or the one that was on top, like to facilitate this they felt like maybe it had to be somebody of a certain race or gender um that had to be like the mascot or the face of something but um times have changed here hierophant right here at the bottom times have fucking changed See, the devil card and the lover's card have the same people on it. One is in reference to not being free to make a decision, being chained or bound to your decisions. And the other is in reference to making free will choice and decision. And with one clarifying the other, that means to me that somebody is bound and we did we have two nines right here so something is definitely coming into balance with the two fours and the two nines um but someone feels bound or trapped or imprisoned because of your freedom so your freedom entraps someone else in their lives but let's talk about these two nines right here Scorpio, King of Cups, and the Two of Pentacles, clarifying the Three of Swords. We have the Eight of Wands right here, a bunch of um, incoming communication messages. Um, I heard telecom, so telecommunication. Excuse me. So somebody may be speaking a lot. I My, my throat just got dry. Um, I heard acceptance, so something, somebody, some, some sort of acceptance. Um, I'm hearing things like fair and equal and things like that. Somebody wants to honor somebody with something. Is somebody being accepted and honored with some? I picked up on this a while back. Somebody wanted to, they wanted to honor somebody with like some sort of honorary doctorates or honorary degree um, in something. And it was going to propel somebody's career in a certain field uh, forward, but that was being held back. Now someone feels like they missed the opportunity to do something by holding something back because now they feel like you're holding something back from them when you're completely open and honest and an open book to the world. With this woman being naked on this card that's based, and the woman being naked here on the star card, that's basically about being transparent. being an open book so somebody's story with this eight of wands right here is, is is out for the world to see I 
I'm going to clarify this uh, Ace of Swords, King of Swords. Let's see, with this Hangman. Yeah, somebody was being all of like um, this Piscean energy because Hangman and the uh, Nine of Cups is Pisces energy. Oh, that's three nines. Yeah, somebody really thought that they was finna get somebody. Some uh, Pisces thought that they was finna get um, somebody caught up. And something that had to do with a car or traveling or distance something that had to do with distance so somebody tried to also cut corners when it came to like I don't know what this is because y'all know I do distance Reiki I got a lot of people who watch me that um you know come from the Reiki crowd now um so this could even be somebody saying that you did something like some sort of distance healing or you did some sort of energy projection that could be the eight of wands toward their pet or their animal or something like that. Um, they went to go see somebody to try to have you stopped or to see how they could stop you or what could be done to stop you. But there's some sort of receipts in reference to that. OK, some sort of distance or traveling at a short distance. All right. Because the three of wands it represents a distance, the world represents a distance, and the chariot also represents traveling or going at a distance. And we see Lord Ganesha is the removal of obstacles, opening roads. We have Queen of Swords right here, judgment. This is feminine law enforcement or you know, officer of the court. So there is a female judge who is a also high priestess who knows what's going on in the background who's keeping secrets something in reference to someone's platform here <clears throat> and the page of cups cancer scorpio pisces and some sort of message this is good news when pages are upright that's good news page of cups is re messages of romance Feelings, intuition. So somebody had a feeling about something. All right. So some sort of judgment is going to be made or has already been made that somebody is keeping a secret in the background. They want to keep somebody from knowing about this as long as possible. I feel like what they're trying to do is um, someone is keeping something from you that could could have propelled you forward way faster in the past they were trying to think of a way to try to pause you or stop you or make you not believe enough in yourself so that you would self-sabotage yourself um and they were doing these things in hopes of binding you to bad decisions or not being able to make a decision in reference to something um this could also be in reference to balancing out your feminine masculine energy here um and like I said, having an unbiased opinion or being able to just balance and heal um, with something. Somebody was overdoing their manipulation or control here in the past. And they decided to take action um, toward their healing, toward their own, their own health. All right, so a lot of things being said. Keep doing the right thing. If, if you are doing the right thing, if you're on the right side of this, keep telling your truth, keep living your truth because it's fucking people up. And like I said, I feel like somebody is just trying to hold back whatever this is. Whatever this is, they don't have access to it. Like they have access to it because they have something that's physical or tangible or something that's supposed to, they were supposed mm -hmm. to give to you or reveal to you or say to you or something like that. And somebody did not. So maybe somebody asked for a service, asked for 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 somebody to be like a middleman and hey, can you ask such and such to do something for me or this or that? And um, it was like, yeah, nah, this person did this, this, and that, and it, it killed this person, or it got this person dying, or blah. like some sort of rumor that somebody had. Um, but either way, what they're doing is, if this is something tangible like money or a check or something like that, I don't even know why I said that. But if this is something like that, then um, somebody is definitely trying to hold it back from you long enough for you to fuck up your own life. So that way, by the time they're supposed to give it to you anyway, you're in jail. 
you know what I'm saying? And it goes to um, somebody else that you're connected to in this. We have Archangel Haniel, friendship, moon cycles, and psychic abilities. So somebody's definitely been, um, somebody's friend has been um, doing something or they have a friend that's been doing something um, on the moon cycles in reference to your psychic ability we have the crown chakra right there with a purple so maybe somebody has been doing some sort of spell work or somebody paid for some sort of spell but right above that we have archangel michael so you're protected he's clearing away anything that's being done to your crown chakra anyway commander ashtar you are a star seed all right space travel and and a galactic guide all right archangel rockwell relationship healing and calm harmony so that's how you are balancing that yin and yang okay all right mind body and spirit if nobody told y'all today i'm gonna tell you i love you peace